Yes, thank you so much for having us here. Thank you, Stefan. Thank you, Alga. Thank you, Sasha, for what you're going to do for me. <laughs> Yes, this is our first day of hunting with Dito. We start hunting today and we hope we shoot something. He's our client for a long time. He's very good in hunting, shooting nice in the bull. So we hope we can shoot a buffalo or something else. So we start. Good luck.
not far, not far. Yeah. You see, it's facing to you. Mm -hmm. It's not okay. Now, oh, it's gone. We saw a wildebeest, and we tried to track him and see if we can get a chance to shoot. But we, unluckily, we they were mixed together with the impala. Now Impala saw us first, they ran together, they stopped, but we didn't get a chance to shoot because he was not staying there for a long time. So we keep on now walking to the water hole. Maybe we find something there we can shoot, or that's how hunting it is. There's Impala there. You can see the ass, but it's facing to us. Just do like this. In the middle, you see the horns. Yes, the Impala. Check, check the, yes, the one with the horns. Good. Well done. Let's go close. Mm -hmm. Well done. Mm -hmm. Good shot. Mm -hmm. Ditto. Yeah, well done. Well done. And the congratulations. Very Thank good you. shot. Straight to the heart. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Very good. Old, old Impala. Mm -hmm. You see? We saw a wheelie beast just up there, like 500 meters. We tried to to shoot him, but he get away from us. Then we suggested going, walking, check for the other thing if we find something. Then we saw a impala, 300 meters. Then we tried to get close, close. Then 120 meters, Dito. Shoot very nice, very good shot, straight to the heart. Congratulations, Dito. Good shot. Thank you, James. Mm -hmm. Now we're just walking to the water hole. There normally you can find the wildebeest or artbeast water hole. Then we tried the other day, we, fought, we saw also um, hippo. So we're trying now. We just walk down and see it's 500 meters from here. It's almost half past uh, 12. Finish hunting for this morning. We go for lunch and then we carry on hunting. Day one, we just finished our lunch. Now we're gonna carry on.
now half past five. We are now walking to the water hole, checking there. We have seen many times a lot of sign of heart beast, weird beast, buffalo also, sometimes also hippo. We just go and try and see what's happened there. Okay, first day is done, but it was like warming up. We got a nice impala this morning, then we get prepared for tomorrow. Second day of hunting, whatever we see, like heart beast, wildebeest, buffalo, Auto, anything we see, we can shoot today. Now just walking down to the water, see what is happening there, about 700 meters from here. And the wind is good. Now we try for whatever we see, at beast, with the beast, Buffalo, lion, elephant. <laughs> so, Under the horns, like one feet from the horn down. Yes. Good. Good shot. Yes. You see? That's a good shot. Yes, it was a good shot, but just a, maybe five centimeters lower, but it, yes but he could not go far. Yes, we 
Another morning, we walked down to the water hole and we found a, a hearty beast, but all of them was a female. At the end, we saw a bull. We could not get a chance to shoot. We decided to walk in front. Then we saw a group of hearty beasts together with wild beasts. We check and we find this nice trophy, wildebeest, standing alone, a bull, Nyasa wildebeest. And Dito did a good job, straight to the heart, like normal. Very good shot, and congratulations, Dito. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're just burning the grass because it's too high. If you want like a hard beast or wildebeest, some places also, even if you want a buffalo, you cannot see even the shoulder, you just see the horns in the back. You cannot get a chance to shoot. And we're just burning because this grass, if it's drying up, is not also good food for the, for the animal. They start coughing and this and this, so we burn to make clear. We need new grass, and you can see the weather now. Anytime we start raining, the grass, new grass, the green one will start coming out. So we have to burn, we need the new grass. We miss. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> How do you like me so far? Yeah, it's a good one. I'm going to go home and clap. Happy birthday again. Just so everybody knows. I don't wear it. I don't wear it. You like? Yes. Yeah. It's my art. Your birthday. Yeah. Oh, three days <laughs> Third day, and if we see anything, buffalo, we shoot. They will see up to evening what is going to happen. We 
were driving up, uh, down to the water hole and uh, we saw a buffalo coming out from, from the water, running to our side, to the left hand side. It's a dagger boy, a single bull. Now we're trying to track him and see if we get a chance to shoot him. With these leaves, you can hear from far. And you see, we came like this and starting turning around so it can go with the wind. Yes. We had the lunch with our friends. They come to visit us. We just say bye bye for them tomorrow. Then we are on the way back to camp. But if we see something like a buffalo, we shoot. Safe, 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 safe. Congratulations, well thank you, done. Thank you, guys. Very good thank shot. Good okay. And uh, you see, you got very old, old, old. Yes. All tips are worn down. You see, normally could be like here, but now worn down. Okay. But it's very good trophy. You can keep for a long time.
buffalo, a single bull just in front of us, like 200 meters. He runs this side. Now we try to track him and we see if we can, uh, we, we're gonna get the chance to shoot him. Wait until they stand up. You see him? Wait. Let me put like this. Keep ready. And he's standing up now. What is this one? I put the safe off one. Shoot That's a reward. <laughs> <laughs> good shot. Thank you. Yes, it's good. Yes, it was a good you. shot. No, the first one was good. That's, that's why he could not run far. <laughs> okay. <laughs> a typical dagger boy. <laughs> Yes, this one was very nice. Yes, very nice. We just saw this buffalo, and uh, because he was running, then we check him, we find he's a good buffalo, old bull, single bull, a dagger boy. Then we decided to track him. We follow like uh, three hours, but he, the way he was running, looks like he, he want to go to the water, then he saw us, then he changed the mind, going back, and he went all the way around, round. Then he started coming back to the same water hole, but there's another water hole just behind us, like 200 meters. Then we saw him in the opening with the wildebeest, artebeest, warthog. So we, had, we have to use the chance. He was very far for shooting. We normally shoot buffalo not more than 100 meters, but this one was like 130. 
Because of this wildebeest, water hog and heart beast, we cannot go closer than that. Then Dito, we ask Dito, can you make it? Then he says, yes, I can do. Put the shooting stick and they shot him very good, right on the shoulder. And as you know, buffalo always are strong, strong enough. He decided running, but he slowly, slowly, he was very sick. And we put more and more just for safe defense. Then we got him. Dito did very good job. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Thank you. Yes. We're still looking for one buffalo, two hippo, eland, wildebeest, beast, but we're still uh, like a week left. I'm sure Dito is ready there. And, uh, Sasha, we hope we get them before they left. The second from the left, even the, the third. Yeah, my big guy. Yeah, good shot. Congratulations. Good job. Mm -hmm.
Yes, it's day eight today. We're still continuing to hunt um, hippo, buffalo. We go to the other side, different area, to check for the hippo and buffalo. Yeah, we saw four bulls of buffalo. Just um, like 150 meters. But they are watching us. Now they start running. We wait 15 minutes, then we try, we follow them and see if we can see them and shoot. Then about 200 meters from the um, second water, we found them. And bad luck, the wind was not good, going straight to them. Then they, they ran. And we know buffalo, if we chase them two times, then they become clever. We decide to leave them and try for the next one. Yes, we saw a buffalo 400 meters from here. Now we're trying to go close and we'll see if we get the chance to shoot. Shoot. 
That was my cousin. No, he saw him. 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 He Yeah. Well, you held shot. It was about four shots. Who else shot? <laughs> but but the, the first shot was good. Problem with this tall grass. If he's wounded and sleepy, accident will happen. Yeah, because you see him, he was lying there. The I saw him afterwards mm -hmm. with, with, with the rifle. Yes. Oh, with my eyes. I did yeah, see him. yes, yes. With the rifle, I did see him. Yes. I was waiting until he was standing. So now, because otherwise you see, I would have shot him in the head. Yes. Mm -hmm. We had lunch and we start coming back to camp. You can see the hills everywhere. So on top of that hill, we saw a buffalo like 400 meters from us. Then we tried to walk down and to get a shot. Then we went around, but uh, you can see high grass. We could not see him. Went around, we tried to climb the tree to check, but we didn't see him. Then we tried to go in. We found him lying down. You can see just a boss. And uh, Sasha made a very nice shot, the first one. You can see the blood coming out from the nose. But uh, it was difficult situation. You can see the grass and everything, and the time also was gone. So we have to put more. Then we finish it just uh, maybe 20 meters from the place uh, where he got the first shot. So it's a nice buffalo. You can see how big boss it is. It's very good one, very nice. So nothing more just to say congratulations to Sasha. Thank you. Very good shot. Thank you. And you got a very nice buffalo. Thank you. And thanks for your help, guys. Congratulations. Super job. Super job. Thank you. Very good. Now we're hunting hippo, hippo and eland. We just go with Dito, like normal. We try to shoot hippo or eland. Then we'll be done for today. There's a lot of people to this water, big, big water. Now we walk, maybe we'll get the chance to see them shooting area. Sometimes they go in the water and we'll see what happens. The one is getting in the water now. You see, yes. he's walking now, to, he's looking to the right. Yes. He's a male. But there we need profit short because there's a lot of people in this thicket. The 
one in the middle. Yes. Yes. Just put between the eye and ear. Yeah. Shoot again. Maybe I changed it too far. Shoot again. The one in front, the one on the right. Shoot again on the right. First one. Yeah, I see him. Tito, come. Come, Tito. Tito, come. My care, me, Tito. Tito, show him she's in the cup. It's the one. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Pull it, pull it, huh? No, no. Pull it in the cup, please. No, no, damn, pull your skill. Now, when it turns nice on the head in the side, huh? Good shot. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay, up. Okay. Come train us to let's see, like, huh? Come. Come see, Yes, as, a, as a we planned this morning, we are planning for Hippo or Eland. So we just drive from camp to this water hole here and we saw Hippo, but it, we left the car 300 meters from the water hole. We start walking and we saw three Hippo just on the bank and uh, we went close, close enough and we checked, there was a female and a young male, and this was a big bull. Then we spoke to Dito, it's a nice one. Got the shot, but he hit the water first and went to the, between the ears, ear and the eye. Then he started running, and you can see there's big thicket here, there's a lot of people inside sleeping there, we cannot let him go. Then we put some, some bullets, injection just to, to make him stopping. Then we went all the way around to trek, but luckily he was coming back to the water. Then Dito make very nice shot, two shot, just to the right place, to the brain. Then he dropped him, he was in the water. Then we went in, put the rope, we drag him out. Now we get him. Congratulations Dito. Well done. Thank you. Tom. Very good you shot. Very good yes. Good shot.
Yeah, we have done with the hippo. Now we're just going back to camp, about three hours drive. Another morning, day 10, we carry on with hunting. We're looking for the another hippo, water, eland. If we find the big lion, yes. Just walking down to the river, there's a, a hole with water. Normally, you can find the hippo there, but it's a little bit deep. We're going to check and see if we get the chance to shoot. Yes, maybe when it's hot, hot, they come back. It's time for lunch now. We tried for hippo. We went to that hall, but they are not in. They already went to the thicket. We think maybe when it's hot, hot, they come back to the water. So we. We go on the way back, we try to check again. So for now, because we're hunting hippo, we have to go to the water holes and this we have been passing more than four water holes. We are just looking for water today and tomorrow we go for the hippo. We go this side, there's no big water holes for the hippo, so we go and check if we find a big, big water hole, then we shoot and tomorrow we go for the hippo.
because we just finished our lunch. Now we go back, trying to look for a big water. Hog. If we find him, we'll shoot. Otherwise, if we don't find today, we just go back to camp and we try tomorrow. We're just going for the hippo and the auto. It's too far from here for the hippo. Maybe we drive for three to yeah, three hours. It's a day for Sasha to shoot this hippo. Planning to hunt a hippo this morning. So we drive all the way. We saw a hippo down there in the in the hole. So we need to make a plan how to, to shoot him because we don't know if he's a female or male.
Okay, Sasha. Well done. Thank good you. shot. Thank you, James. <laughs> Thank you. Very good shot. Thank you for your help. <laughs> you are welcome. We are hunting hippo from this morning up to now, one o'clock. Finally, it's a successful safari. We got a nice hippo. We just find him in the hole in the water and we chase him away. When he went out and Sasha make a very good shot. He ran like 100 meters, then he's down. Congratulations for the hippo. Thank you, James. Thank you, guys. Mm -hmm. Carlo, thanks for your help. Mm -hmm. fun. Thanks for your help. Guys, thanks for the support. Yes, we are done for today. We shot this hippo now on the way back to camp. I think hunting is finished now. So we are finished with the safari of Dieter and Sascha. We had a great time, a lot of fun and a good success. We got all the animals they wanted. So we are all very happy. And then maybe James and then also Ken can give you a bit of a summary of the whole thing. But everything turned out well and fine. James. Yes, we, as Stefan says, we hunted very good. We shot everything, including two buffalo, two hippo, and so on. So it was very good safari with the Dito, Sasha, very successful. They are very good people. We look like a family, but they are client. <laughs> very good, and we are very happy. Today they are leaving. Also, we say to them, safe flight home. They are welcome again, and welcome everyone to our area. Very good hunting place. You get everything that you need. Okay, thank you very much. And uh, Kenny will carry on. Thank you, thank you. Uh, very big thank, thank you, to, uh, thank you. Uh, Dito and Sasha for coming through. Mm -hmm. uh, we're definitely gonna miss you guys. It's been a hell of a fun trip. And uh, we look forward to seeing you back here next year again. So cheers to that and God bless. Safe travels back. Cheers, uh, guys. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs>